Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Eddie Marcus here again. And I'm still on that mission of trying to introduce you to an invisible power that you cannot see here again, cannot touch, cannot feel. And yet the evidence of all of the things that exist that human beings, you and I, had nothing to do with the establishment thereof, and yet they exist by that power. That power. And I'm trying to get us as human beings to believe in that power because as all of this other stuff exists and it is maintained unity and for real, authentic, then it indicates that we as a people have the possibility to exist likewise without all of the things that go on that destroys and tears it up. So ladies and gentlemen, you know a lot of times when I talk to you, I talk about plan that God could put in play or uh, has put in play for those who follow it that would bring certain th things that every individual on the face of the earth wants. And uh, I notice this comes kind of close to socialism. And you would think that it's sort of model socialism a little after that. And yet when you hear people in a capitalistic system talk, they talk about socialism as if it's the worst thing anybody can ever imagine. You talk about people having the necessities of life and they made the decision about how it was going to happen and stuff like that. That's a bad thing. And yet when you start talking about capitalism, a system, an economic system, should I say, and political, in which a country's trade, and his industries are all controlled by private owners for profit rather than the people controlling a system, a system that works for them, utilizing resources that were given to them. And yet you come up with a system that allows others to find some way to maneuver and conquer and capture all of the resources and then create a system that utilizes your service, your work, for their benefit, even though it has to involve giving you a little kickback so you can buy those things that you made for your entire life. Well, <coughs> and then you speak about a democracy, the thing that you want to hold over everybody about the, throughout the world, and you use it to say that it's a system of government by the whole population by the whole population. And to say that means that the pain and suffering that is endured within that system, that the neglect, the, the, the evilness that exists within that system is approved by the people. You can't say some of the people because this says democracy is government controlled by the whole population. The whole population. And so you find out that whether you're talking about socialism or whether you're talking about uh, capitalism or you're talking about democracy or you're talking about dictatorships or whatever you're talking about, you're always going to find the, the, the same outcome. Some got, some not. Pain and suffering, poverty, crime and violence, terror and war, all of these things are going to exist wherever evil runs the show. And so, no one has the authority to brag about who is righteous. In no place on the face of the earth. We are all in the same boat. We are all being controlled and deceived by evil. You heard it said that in the beginning, the day that you listen to another, that's how I interpret it. I have instill within you the plan of life just as I have a heart and kidneys and things of this nature in your body. I have also given you that plan of life what is proper and what is not. So follow that. And the day that you choose not to follow that when you decide to listen to something else, someone else uh, interpretation and it causes thus and thus and thus. It is because it is not mine. It is because it is a dead. And it's taking and robbing you of life. And since that time, that's what we've been doing. 
We've always been trapped by that. Kings and queens and Caesars and Pharaohs who wanted everybody to think that they were connected with God and they had the right plan and they just used people to be slaves and murdered them and did whatever they wanted to them to keep them in line as they stole all the resources and they fought other nations to take resources. All a big demonic force. I call it all hell. People lost in trying to run the show. Well, anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I want to hold up for a minute. 